Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are in the world. My name is Jorik Sikkes, and in this video, I want to talk a little bit about what I have done today and what I'm really happy about. If you see my YouTube videos, then you know that I have been working on a fully automated automatic funnel that I want to create for my business in order to uh, really scale my company and uh, be able to create a bigger impact on the world. Positive impact, of course. But when I tried my funnel, I have did it a bunch of times now, it all sort of failed. Now, I, I didn't get a lot of email addresses and people who would register for my free training, but that would be that. It was actually one sale of $7 that I got, which is already a really uh, big win, but there was something missing. There was something that didn't work because when the funnel works, it at least breaks even so that you can keep it running. Because if you do not break even, you lose money. There's only a limited amount of money that you have that you can actually keep it running for, unless you have a lot of infinite amount of money stashed somewhere. I don't. So yeah, that's basically the goal to at least get a break even and then get it profitable so that it can keep running and basically automate your entire marketing operation. By the way, uh, if that's something is, is if that is something that you would like for your own business as well, which I don't see why not, but um, yeah, leave a comment or just uh, visit my website growlikebamboo.com so that we can get connected and I might be able to help you out with that. Anyway, um, what I where I was going with this video is that uh, today I have gotten a breakthrough in my thinking. Like I was focused on okay I, I created some products and i just i thought they naturally flowed together but when i thought about it and used the material that i've learned from uh, alex ramosi his book on how to create grand slam offers uh, he calls them 100 million dollar offers there was this process that he explained where first that you should know who you're actually selling to and i've done a lot of thinking on that part and I know who I want to target. So in my case, I want to target uh, people who are consultants or authors or experts and they, uh, they care about sustainability. They find sustainability important, the 16 sustainable development goals. They're interested in that sort of thing. And that is my target market. Now for the product that I was selling or that I wanted to get to them to help them uh, to help this avatar, which I call PJ, is what I call the Bamboo Sales Assistant. And in the Bamboo Sales Assistant, I give them a free training on how to get 15 leads per month. But uh, I recently went through the material myself and tested this system again. And I got not, not in three, 30 days, I got 15 leads in three days, which is very interesting. Um, <clears throat> That, anyway, that's not the point, but I teach people how to do this. The thing I sold after it, so the upsell, was called the Bamboo Snack Kit. And in the Bamboo Snack Kit, I talked about how to discover 20% of the work that will get you 80% of the results. Now, that is interesting, maybe by itself, but it does not, it's not a logical follow-up to the first product. See, the first product was how to get leads, right? And today I created the next logical sequence. So what would be the next step or the next problem that you will have if you get 15 leads in three days or in 30 days, whatever? What would be the problem? What do you think? Well, first of all, a lead is not a, a client yet, right? So you need to know how to transform these leads into paying customers and you want paying customers that uh, pay enough so that you don't have to acquire a whole lot of them for example so an average of one thousand dollars per client would be a good average a great average so i've already done this i've already tested that and done that in the past with this system. So I thought that's the next logical thing. That's the thing that I need to teach next. That's the thing that I can sell when they see my free training. So if you have a free training, now you get leads for free. Great. How to, how to make them into a client, right? 
And then what is the next problem that they get after that? So imagine you're a sustainable consultant and you get now 15 leads in three days and <laughs> that means you get around 150 leads in 30 days. That's insane, by the way. 150 leads in 30 days if you keep on running it for an entire month. What is the next problem if you also manage to get them into clients? Can you figure, do you know what it is? Can you take a guess? Well, the logical answer here is that they will get overwhelmed <laughs> with all the things they have to do now. 150 leads, which means 150 appointments that you have right now. How do you manage that? How do you manage all the clients that, that you'll be getting? And if, um, <clears throat> I think two strategies to deal with this, like you just turn it off, the system that I, I teach, that's the simple one, but um, if you know anything about sustainable business, one of the main things to keep a sustainable business is have a consistent lead flow, have leads keep flowing into your business. It's basically the lifeblood of your business. So you don't want to turn it off, but you don't want to get overwhelmed by it. You don't want to work yourself into a burnout. That is not sustainable as well. So what do you do? You find a way to manage it. You find a way to outsource. You find a way to automate. You find a way to make it manageable. So there are a few ways to do that and I thought about that and that is my next upsell. So when they learn how to do the leads and then they learn how to turn those leads into clients and how to react on LinkedIn and whatnot, then they need a system on how to manage all of this, right? Right. And then I thought, so that's my first upsell. So the main offer is basically the how to make the leads into clients and the free offer is how to get the leads and then how to manage it all is my first upsell the second upsell basically is how to maximize so how to maximize because not only with this system will you get a lot of leads you will get a lot of email addresses you will get a lot of connections and you will get a lot of clients so how to maximize the value out of all of these parties the connections the leads the the, the clients how do you do that and for that, you need for for uh, you need to start posting. You need to start doing content marketing, and you need to start doing all these kinds of things. Not only with the platform, but you also need to do it on your site. So, what do you need to do on your website? What do you need them to do on the social platforms? And there's all these things. There's all these questions that you have, and this is what I call my sustainable growth box. So it's basically one of the pillar products that I have, and. Um, for that, that, that building out for my business, which will make it so that, well, when you get the bamboo growth kit or the sustainable growth kit, you will have everything that you need to get your business to a six digit company and keep it there sustainably or move beyond that if you would want to. Not everybody wants to. In fact, most people do not want to move beyond the six digits. And I first I thought that was crazy, but I get these people now because when you go to se to seven digit business, it's a lot of responsibility. You get millions, but because <clears throat> money, I see it as there's a responsibility tied to it. Because if you want to get that money, you need to give more value than that money is worth, <laughs> and that's a lot of responsibility, a lot to do. But in this day and age, we have automation, we have um, things that we can do to outsource it. Anyway, that was my rant, that was my uh, thing that I discovered today. And if this sounds something that is interesting to you, just let me know and we'll talk about it. Thank you, bye.